Hey everyone, it's Emily and today I'm here with a new video and this is so exciting for me. I've never filmed this before and I've done a pretty big haul. This is like my, this was what I bought myself for my birthday and I'm so excited. Um, it's a Bath and Body Works haul as you can tell by the title. Um, so I've got some fall candles. And I've got some summer candles because it's spring and oh my god they're so good. When I opened the box all I could smell was you know raspberry and cinnamon and oh it was so good. So I took everything out of the packaging. I haven't smelt them like only what I smelt from the box and I did order some other things that came as a free gift. So let's get started. So I might start with the summer scents, since we're in spring, so that's what I should be burning, even though, let's face it, I'm burning autumn because it's what I'm on the other side of the world. So I got Tiki Mango um, because it was like $10, it was really cheap, and I love mango, mango's probably one of my favourite fruits. And I just thought it would be really interesting to try it. Um, I'm trying to branch out from my... I'm very um, restricted in what I choose for my candles. So I thought... I've never been disappointed in any Bath & Body Works candles I've ever bought. So I thought, why not branch out and try something new? So I got Tiki Mango. And it's Mango Nectar, Jasmine Flower and Sun-Kissed Grapefruit. And you can definitely smell the mango, um, but I love the um, grapefruit in here because it sort of counteracts the really sweetness of the mango. It's really beautiful. I'm really looking forward to burning that and seeing how it burns. I also love the packaging and the colour of the wax. It's really pretty. I ordered these like end of July and I got them sent to a US address and then I had them shipped here so that's why it's taken so long to get here but the wait is so worth it and I'm just going to put them on the bench down in front of you if you're wondering why I'm bending down there. So this was the one I was super excited for. I actually ordered two of these. Um, this is the Raspberry Citrus Swirl. And it's red raspberries and citrus and passion fruit juice. Passion fruit juice. I love passion fruit. Passion fruit is probably my favourite fruit. Um, and my mum and my dad grow it. And when they come and visit me, they bring passion fruit. And I don't know, passion fruit is a very um, sentimental fruit for me for some reason. Like I get really emotional about it. Oh, you can really smell the red raspberry. It's really sweet. But there is this slight undertone of citrus. I can't... I can't really smell the passion fruit, but it's probably... It's probably, um... The sourness. It's... It's got this really sweet layer that you initially smell. Um, I'm not great at describing scents. I just enjoy trying to describe them. Um, and then as you, as it sort of builds, you can smell the sourness, um, which is really refreshing. That's really beautiful. I'm really excited about that one. I will probably burn those two more in the summertime, like not so spring. This one, oh my God, the packaging. This is pomegranate lemonade, and for those of you who know me, you know that pomegranate um, scents in candles are my favourite. Pomegranate is amazing in candles. Um, so this one, I love the pink. I can't wait to empty these and use them to put um, makeup brushes and hair ties or whatever I want to put in them. So this says freshly squeezed lemon juice, pomegranate and nectar with a touch of sugar. 
Oh yeah. First you smell the pomegranate and it's quite tangy but then you also smell the the lemon um, and it's also quite tangy. That's actually a really zesty candle. That would be really nice for this time of year like when you're cleaning, you know, spring cleaning and you want your house to smell really fresh and zesty. That's really beautiful. I really like that one. This one I was a bit nervous about, um, but I thought I would, you know, open the boundaries and see how we go. This is the Golden Pineapple Lao candle. And once again, isn't that wax just the most beautiful thing ever? I absolutely love pineapple. I love fruit in general. That's why I buy fruit scented candles. Um, but I was really nervous as to like a pineapple candle. I'm not too sure. But anyway, it was really cheap and I thought, well, why not try it? So this says it's a uh, Mai Tai blend of Maui pineapple, tropical hibiscus and luscious papaya. Now, papaya is one of those fruits that I don't like. So this might be a bit of a no, but it will probably still be really nice to burn in summer. Like, it's not like I'm eating it. Ooh. Yeah, you can really smell the pineapple. I really like the tanginess of the pineapple. I can't smell the papaya, which is good. I'm also not a huge fan of coconut scents for some reason. I know that's probably most people's favorite. But it's, yeah, it's not my favourite at all. So I was very um, choosy when it came to the fruit fragrances because Bath & Body Works combine a lot of fruit fragrances with coconut and I'm not a huge coconut person, so I skip those. This one is the one I'm the most excited for. This is part of the Autumn Fall range and it's Spiced Pomegranate Cider because pomegranate, Emily, we go together like a match made in heaven. <laughs> um, so this is ruby red pomegranate, sweet apple cider, mulled blackberry, and star anise. <gasps> this is going to be so good. And I love, I love the packaging, the um, copper lid with this beautiful wax. Like, is that not the most beautiful wax you've ever seen in your life? Like, really? Oh. oh, I really like the star anise in that. It's really fruity, but really spicy fruity. Oh, I really like that. I think I might burn that one at Christmas time because obviously it's summer in Australia, but you still want some of those spicy layers in your house. That would be so nice. Okay, so next we have a pumpkin scent which is very exciting. Um, my next haul is going to be a lot more fall, um, but I had to get some this time because why not? They had just been released. Um, so this is Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin, and this again was really cheap. It was like 10 US dollars, and I'm really excited to try this one. I think I might burn this one over Halloween even though we don't really celebrate. Oh. That's really beautiful. Really beautiful. Um, oh, I didn't read the notes. Yes. Pumpkin, spice, clove, vanilla cream, brown sugar. I can really smell the clove. It really breaks up the really sickly sweetness of the pumpkin and you can really smell the brown sugar that one's really beautiful not that all of them aren't but they're all beautiful in their own way and once again the packaging like can we just appreciate the packaging it's so cute they do such a good job this one is um, a favorite that I've bought you know, in previous years and this is marshmallow fireside some 
sweet sense, I get a bit overwhelmed and feel a bit sick. Um, but this one is absolutely stunning. It's the most realistic marshmallow on fire side um, scent I've ever smelled in my life. I don't like the grey, but I see where they're going with that because, yeah, marshmallows. So this is toasted marshmallows, smouldering woods, far roasted vanilla and crystallised amber. Oh, yes, I love this one. I love the the woody notes in it with the fiery notes. I don't know how to explain it. It's like, it's so genuine. And the sweetness of the marshmallow, that one is so beautiful. I need to get more of these. And probably one of my all-time favourite candles to burn any time of the year. And I know it's technically a autumn scent, but why not? Is leaves. I was also thinking about burning this at Christmas too. Because it's crisp red apple, golden nectar and clove spice. It's just, it's so beautiful. The apple is so fresh and fruity and tangy. And then you've got the cinnamon and the clove, and that's one of my favourite candles from Bath and Body Works. If you're going to do an order, you have to order this candle. It's it's my top candle. So yeah, it's really beautiful. So um, when I did my order, there was a promotion going on where if you spent so much, you got a gift bag, and the gift bag came, gift bag came with this cute little pineapple which I don't think I would particularly use but um my aunt's granddaughter would love this so I might put some little makeup goodies in there for her and gift it to her for Christmas then it came with this really pretty um tote bag and it just looks like this it's got these fake leather handles and it's like a car not khaki calico fabric with these gold metallic stripes. It's just the perfect beach bag. Um, and then it came with these goodies for free. And most of them um, I'm not hugely enthusiastic about. So I actually thought I would give them as Christmas presents. So we have the Endless Weekend um, body lotion. And it looks like this. And it's Mandarin Sunkissed Magnolia Lychee Sorbet, Raspberry Lychee Sorbet, and Coconut Water and Vanilla Sandalwood. So it's a really fresh summer scent. And I know somebody who would absolutely love that for Christmas. And it also came with the body wash, which looks like this. The packaging's really pretty. I really like the colour. So I thought I would gift somebody these two for Christmas. And then I got this gorgeous set, which is Strawberry Picnic. We've got the body lotion, the shower gel, and the body mist, which the packaging is adorable. So I'm going to give this to one of my best friends. Um, for Christmas. She will love that and I've got a few other little goodies for her for Christmas. I'm really excited about that because they're gifts that you can't buy in Australia and yeah. So then it also came with the Endless Weekend Body Mist which... Let me spritz it. Yeah, that's really nice. Really nice for summer. Um, so I will keep that for myself because I love their body mists. And then it also came with this really gorgeous Boardwalk Vanilla Cone Foaming Hands Wash. And I love their hand washes so much. I don't usually splurge on them too much, or I try not to. Because you can get really carried away on the Bath and Body Works store, I tell you. So the last few things I have are pocket packs. 
and I got the um, summer set. Came in this little baggie. So we have liquid sunshine, which is a citrus scent. Boardwalk vanilla cone, which is, again is that vanilla ice cream scent that goes with the foaming hand wash. And this one's really zesty. Mm, I really like that one. That one is very Emily. Um, this one I was really excited for. Cherry Sun... Cherry Berry Burst. Just Peachy. I love the name of that one. It's so cute. And then we have Cool Coconut Colada. And this one, I will give to my friend with the strawberry set. I would think she would really love that. So I'm so excited about this. And then the last thing I got was a sleeve. Because I couldn't help it. I was actually thinking of gifting it to my mum for Christmas. But I don't know. She doesn't burn a lot of candles. Um... Yeah, I don't know. I might have to keep it for myself. And it's, it's this gorgeous owl sleeve for the three-week candles. Just fits in there like that. And I really loved it. It's just really, like you could put it out at Christmas, in spring, sort of any time of the year. It's really gorgeous. Um, so that is everything I got from Bath and Body Works. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. It's a bit of a different video for me. And I look forward to filming these videos a lot more frequently. Probably like twice a year. When I do a big order. Um, next order I want to do is some more of the fall scents and then Christmas scents. Because my addiction is the um, cranberry, frosted cranberry candle from Buff and Body Works. It's my favourite. So, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoy it and I'll see you next time. Bye! Everything that you like when we go crash We come back every time We never go out of style We never go out of style We come back every time